Hi everyone, welcome to MyQtunes. Grab your favorite markers, come along with me and let's draw our favorite characters together. Let's draw BMAX together from Rags Kids Club. We're gonna take our markers and we're gonna start with BMAX's nose and then after that his mouth. So let's start. Now I'm gonna start here in the middle of the page. And we're gonna draw a little nose or a big nose for that matter. And then just the mouth. And then we want to draw an open mouth, like this. And now it's time for the muzzle. Now from the nose, we're gonna make it nice and curvy towards the mouth, but don't touch the mouth yet. Now on the other side, we're gonna do the same. And don't touch the mouth, just leave a little gap open. And then I'm just gonna draw maybe four spots on his muzzle. Now let's do this on the other side as well. Here we go, four spots. And now for the chin. And we're going to start from the muzzle. And we're just going to do the underside of the chin. Let's go to B Max's eyes. I'm going to start here on the top. And we're going to make it nice and round and connect it to the top of the mouth. Or to the top of the muzzle. We'll do the same for the other side. Yeah, light reflections as we always do. And then of course the pupil. Right there. I'll draw the pupil this side. I'm going to do the light reflections and I'm going to fill the pupils in. Now right on top, I'm going to draw a straight line, just above the eyes. And now from the straight line, we're going to draw some here. I'm going to start here on the side. And I'm going to draw these dread lobby sort of here. here. You know what, let's do another one here as well, just to fill in that gap. Now right on top I'm going to draw a hat. Now I'm going to start here and I'm just going to make a little hook. And then I'm just going to follow it around to the top like this. And then we're going to just continue, make every line a bit higher. And this one I'm going to make lower and I'm going to connect it to the top. And we're just going to draw a little line going out like this. So this is a hat. Now from the hat, we can draw Max's ears. Now let's do that. Now on the side, I'm going to start and I'm going to draw a big flappy ear connected to the hair. And I'll just make a little dividing line as well. Now let's do this for the other side. A big flappy ear. Here we go. And then of course. Just draw a little line there as well. Good. Now we're going to go to the bottom and we're going to draw a jacket. Now I'm just going to draw two little hooks coming out like this. And now that I have that, I'm going to start here and I'm going to make a curve upwards and connect it to the ear. And let's do the same for this side as well. So I'm going to start there. You make this curve and you're going to take it upwards and we're going to draw these button shapes as well so B-Max can close his jacket now from there we're going to draw some arms now what I'm going to do I'm going to start here and I'm going to go to the ear and I'll continue this and maybe there as well and now that I have that I'm going to make a straight line down and now I'm going to draw a thumb so I'm going to draw a thumb there a little pad in it. Then I'm just going to draw a line down and I'm going to sort of draw a sh box shape like this and now I can draw fingers so I'm going to draw a little pinky. Then another finger. I'm just going to draw three fingers and then maybe the index finger right there and a little pad there. Now we can jump to the other side so let's jump there. And again, we're going to start here at the bottom. We're going to make a line there, connect it, and then again, we're going to draw a thumb. And then from the thumb, we're just going to draw a little line to indicate the, where the hand should be. So then, and then we're going to draw the index finger. And 
and then of course lastly the pinky here we go and these are two hands and then of course just a little pad right there now we're gonna go down to Bmax's legs now Bmax is sitting so we're gonna draw a short leg down and another short one down and then right here in the middle I'm just gonna draw a line down and then I'm gonna make this curve which will be on top of his boots like this now let's do this for this side as well we're gonna make this and you're just gonna connect it right there a little bring a skew line out there as well and then right here you're just gonna connect it so this is two front legs and now you're gonna make a line down and you're gonna do this so there's a shoe and on this side you're gonna draw another shoe and then of course you're gonna go down and we're gonna draw the soles of his boots now right below the soles because he's sitting in a wheelchair we're gonna draw a little footstep where you can rest his feet and we're just gonna follow the shape but just smaller inside there we go and then maybe just make a little line there in between now from this footstep I want you to draw a little accent so we're gonna draw a little line out there and maybe a little line out there so now that we have these indication lines we're gonna draw uh, uh, tires so you're gonna draw two small tires I'm drawing it thin at the top and quite wide at the bottom because this is sort of cartoony kind of tires there we go and there's the tread within the tire and then of course you're just gonna make a little line there now we're gonna do this for the other side as well I'll start there from the axle and let's make it nice and wide at the bottom and then of course tread here we go and now for the back tire now the first thing I'm going to do I'm going to start here and I'm just going to draw a piece of metal coming upwards connected there and you're going to do the same thing there as well a little piece of metal there as well and then a little axle coming out and maybe on this side you're going to draw another axle coming out and now that we have that we're going to draw the inner circle of the tire first now I'm going to start here and I'm just going to draw an oval and it goes right there behind and now that I have this oval, we're just going to draw a little inner line as well. And now we can draw the outside of the tire. Now I'm going to start right here. I'm going to make it thin on top. And then I'm going to curve it out wider and I'll make it flat at the bottom. And then of course we can make little traits again on that tire. There we go. Now on the side of the tire, there's sort of this cap that goes over. So I'm drawing the cap right there. And now I can just jump to the other side. Now let's do it first. We're gonna draw the inside of the tire. And then of course we can draw the other inside and then you can start drawing the tire itself. There we go. Wide at the bottom. And then we can maybe just draw some trick as well. And then of course lastly, a little cap over the tire. And there we go in this Bmax. Now check my picture out and try to match the colors. Thank you for drawing with me. Please don't forget to click the like button and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you soon. Bye bye.